Welcome to the Quick Start Guide for the Intoxilizer 500. Let's get started. Once you press the power button to power up your unit, these two buttons are all you'll need to navigate to each function. The large button to select, the small button for next and back. The unit automatically starts up with the option to select BRAC mode, your most common test. Press the large top button to select this mode. Once selected, attach the disposable mouthpiece. Position yourself properly and have the subject blow into the lipped end of the mouthpiece until a sample of the subject's breath is captured automatically. Weight Analyzing will appear on the display and after a few seconds, the subject's three-digit BRAC is displayed. After the BRAC is displayed, you will see Ready on the screen and the unit will be ready for the next test. If one of these two errors are shown on the display, repeat the testing procedure. And while the subject is blowing, press the large top button to sample the breath manually. Once a sample has been accepted, Weight Analyzing will appear on the display. And after a few seconds, the subject's three-digit BRAC is displayed. Navigate to Zero Tolerance Mode and press the large top button to enter zero tolerance test mode. Attach the reusable sampling cup. With the subject's mouth two to three inches from the cup, have the subject blow into the cup until a sample is automatically taken, or the operator overrides automatic sampling by pressing the large top button in order to take a manual sample. Once the sample is taken, weight analyzing will appear on the display, followed by NEG if there is no alcohol present or POS for the presence of alcohol. Zero tolerance mode can also be used to test for alcohol in a beverage by placing the sampling cup above the liquid to be tested and pressing the large top button to check for the presence of alcohol. Once the instrument clears, the unit will automatically reset to ready and the next test can be administered. Navigate to last test recall. Now press the large top button to display the last test result, whether BRAC or zero tolerance. The result is stored in memory even if the unit is powered off and back on again. Navigate to last five tests. Last five tests will flash on the display Use the large top button to select and the last five tests will appear on the display. Attach a new disposable mouthpiece. Be sure it is a new mouthpiece. Navigate to the system menu. This mode will allow you to make sure your instrument is calibrated and set correctly. With system menu on the display, press the large top button to enter the system menu. First up will be calibration check. Press the large top button to select calibration check mode. Standard type dry gas will now display. Once the instrument is ready for calibration, large button sample will display. Then provide a five second sample of your calibration standard through the instrument. Once you've reached five seconds, press and release the large top button. Weight analyzing will now display, and after a few seconds, your three-digit result will display. If the instrument is not within plus or minus .005 of your target value, the unit must be calibrated. Navigate to the calibration mode. Calibration will flash on the display. Now press the large top button to select calibration mode and then press the small bottom button to select the target value of your standard. Pressing the small bottom button will allow you to toggle between dry gas and wet vapor standards. See your user's manual for more details on setting the target value for the correct standard. Be sure to use a new mouthpiece for every calibration check and or calibration adjustment. Once the instrument is properly calibrated, wait 15 minutes, then perform a calibration check to ensure your instrument is accurate. Navigate to set date time.
set date time will flash on the display. Press the large top button to enter the correct date and time. Then follow the on-screen prompts to make the correct adjustments.